The only Yakima News team taking action for you. KIMA Action News starts now. Good evening and thank you for joining us on this Thursday evening. I'm Hunter Phipps in for John Kennedy O'Connor. The Sunnyside Lighted Farm Implement Parade is just two days away. And so we sent Austin. Austin Peppers out there to see what we can expect for the parade and what also they are nationally recognized for in the past. This is the intersection of East Edison Avenue and Barnard Boulevard, where this Saturday at 6.30 p.m., the Sunnyside Lighted Parade is expected to kick off, with about 70 participants expected for the event. Yesterday, we spoke to Carter Killian, whose grandfather was a part of the first parade in 1988. Now in the 35th annual parade, he's helping to put it together. We spoke to him again today to find out who we can expect to see Saturday night. We've got uh, car clubs that come out, um, bring plenty of old cars. There's old tractors, there's semi trucks, all sorts of things. As long as there's, there's lights on it and they sign up. Along with the parade, there will also be a downtown market, which opens at 1 p.m. located towards the end of the parade route with about 22 different food and toy vendors available to the public, as well as Santa Claus making an appearance. Killian mentioned the parade has gotten national recognition from A&E in the past. A couple years back, A&E did an did a, uh, article on this, and it was aired on, on TV. They rated it as one of the top five parades in the nation, and it was really, really cool to, to be able to see that and, and hear that from them. Killian is grateful to see everyone come together for the annual event. It's great to see the community recognized for this and all the volunteers and everybody that's come together to help put this in on, the sponsors, everyone comes together at this time of year and it's, it's just really, really a cool thing to see and, and participate in. The parade will also hand out awards and plaques to the top three participants in their individual category in the parade. Reporting from Sunnyside, Austin Peppers, Action News. Thank you, Austin, and you can catch the parade live with our news team on Saturday at 7 p.m.